Hello everybody, I'm Tom from Plus Grenade, and we're here with a different game today. This is a little game called F1 2012. It's a great racing game, if you're a racing fan of any kind. Um, I'm here, because I'm telling you guys about this new series I'm putting together. Uh, it's called Let's Save Marusha. Um, the car I'm in right now uh, is a Marusha, also known as a Virgin. And it's kind of been going bankrupt in the last couple years of F1. So I'm like going to try to make my own money situation and try to like see if I can bring them out of debt. Like each car I crash is worth a million dollars and stuff like that. I thought it would be pretty cool, pretty interesting. Um, we're here in Sao Paulo, also known as Brazil. And this is actually going to be the last race of the season, which Power is the championship, up. I guess. Um, just doing a quick little quick race, see how things go, make sure everything's up to date and stuff. Uh, we haven't been posting a video in a while, which, you know, isn't the greatest, I guess. Dramatic intro. All right, here we go. Um, right now, I'm racing as Charles Peak. Uh, wait, 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 wait. We always forget this. We always forget doing this. There we go. Now this will never happen again. Hopefully. Uh, and we're away. It's pretty quick. Switch my fuel to rich mixture, and this is going to be chaotic going into the first turn. And break, 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 yep, yep, chaotic. This is a really short track. Um, yeah, like I said, located in Brazil. I believe the name is Interlagos. Um, don't hold me against that. Um, now realizing how difficult it is to comment, oh, 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 commentate by yourself and race. At the same time, uh, so I'm racing on the hardest difficulty with all settings or all assists off except for automatic shifting. Take the turn way wa wide, way way wide. <laughs> um, so yeah, I've, it's shifting automatically for me because I don't want to be concentrating on the game and forget that I'm trying to talk to myself while doing this. It's hard enough to talk to myself and race, and I don't want to make it any harder. Um, so this is that's just basically one lap around this track. It's, like I said, it's really short. Just want to say what's up. How you guys doing? Really? That's cool. We think it'll stay dry for right. Thank you, Mr. Spotter. So, next week, I don't know how many of you guys follow our Facebook, but we announced that next week is Grenade Week in celebration of our channel's one-year anniversary. Uh, I thought that's pretty cool on how we've been having this channel for one year, yet we only posted like ten videos in total. It's just a little interesting fact. But we're, we're trying. Now that school's out and summer vacation, which is like the greatest time of the year. Whoa of everybody's life, summer vacation. Once you get out of school, you realize that June has no significant importance anymore, and it's just another month in the year, and yeah. So, purple, as you see on the mini-map down in the bottom left, means that so far I have the quickest lap of the race, which you probably can say that's not true, but that's mostly because no one actually posted a fastest lap of the race yet. Um, it doesn't really say fastest lap until like lap 2-3. Uh, whoa, I almost wrecked right there. Uh, huh. That's something I'm trying to hopefully not do wreck in this series. Um, like I said, if I ever go bankrupt, 
or reach zero dollars during the series, the series is over. That's it. It's done. That'll be it. Pack up your things and go home, boy. You're done. But that's not what I'm trying to do here. I'm also trying to not use flashbacks, which has a lot of games nowadays, like Forza, I believe, has flashbacks. Where if you wreck, you can hit a button and it will take you like five seconds back in time before you crash. And you can not crash if you do it again. <laughs> well said. So, working lap 3 of 18. That's not my best lap so far. Oh, I go off on the grass. Petrov looking right behind me. Not to be confused with Petrol, which is a gasoline. He is definitely not a gasoline, he is a man. I cannot clarify he is a man. I haven't checked myself. Stay on topic, Tom. <laughs> So, I'm interested on knowing how many of you guys are actually Formula 1 fans. Because... Not a lot of people I know are actual racing fans at all, but... It's interesting to have a sport that's kind of like soccer, where it's just a sport that goes around the world, and takes the best of the best around the world, and... puts them against each other, game after game, or in this case, race after race. And I cannot believe I have not crashed yet so far. I'll multitasking. This is my first take on doing this race. And I am extremely happy on how it's going so far. Uh -huh. You can see my little information box. Lap 13 stop. And that means I'm taking a pit stop on lap 13 for new tires. And that's the grass. That's the other grass. And that's braking zone. So, yes, you will be amazed on how fast these people can change tires, four tires, while under pressure. So there you go, Colvin Line in pitting three laps, that's around lap seven, so I'm definitely pitting way after he is. Um, and, yeah, it's pretty much the basis of this... DRS is, see, like, his back wing has a little slit through it that, like, makes your car go faster so you can pass people easier. But I'm not going to let him pass me, because I'm an evil person. Ha ha ha. Uh, I'm so sorry you guys are watching this video. But yes, the races are going to be longer during, like, the season. And it's gonna be on career mode, so you're gonna actually gonna see my name instead of Pick's last name on the top board. Um, yeah, this game has a lot of interesting features. It's like a simulator, but it's also not. Just because you have all of these information boxes you can turn on and off. Um, this is basically how most people you find on YouTube race, just like this. And if you're wondering why I'm doing so poorly, uh, but as you figure I'd be doing great, uh, this is the hardest difficulty and I'm racing in the worst car. So everyone else is faster than me. Um, I honestly have no idea how I'm not in dead last right now. But, hey. Doing the best I can. That yellow dot that you see on my the mini-map is my teammate and I'm being passed, I'm being passed. No, I'm not. Locked up the tire. How oh, he's still there. Of the Rosa. In that's translation. It's Spanish. I don't need no front end grip. That's a complete lie. <laughs> uh, this game is just fun if you have some alone time and you just want to do some racing. A very interesting aspect of racing where definitely not in like NASCAR where if you hit somebody you get praise from the crowd where in this you get a black flag immediately and that ruins your day completely skipped that turn Kratha Kane behind me that's De La Russa's teammate teammate is cars come out from the same shop 
so they can't, it's not good if they wreck each other. And it's also not good wrecking any, anyone else, really, but... Yeah, I, I listen to my spotter sometimes. Or, I guess he's my crew chief. Racing. So yeah, the races are gonna be longer, and so which means I'm gonna have to find ways to talk to myself for longer amounts of time, and not take these breaks in between my sentences. And I'm wrecking, I'm wrecking, I'm wrecking. Go, 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 go. Oh, he's there. He's there. He's there, and he's not there. Okay, that's enough said. And I think. I think that's the leader way back there, so which means we're probably going to be passed and lapped soon. Yeah, that might either be him or dead last, I don't know. Could be either way. So, yep. Whoa, no, 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 no. No, yep, that's not a yep. And, alright. Wait. I might get DRS. Yes, I got the DRS. I'm looking to the outside. I'm, I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna get him. I'm gonna, he's gonna block me. Alright. <laughs> See if I can't get the slipstream going, which makes my car a little bit faster. However, like you said, loses the front end grip, which is really bad in turns. And I'm gonna see if I can't under. Wow, that just snapped loose. Uh, here's the rewind button, like I told you guys. <laughs> Flashbacks. Oh, all right. Wow. Yep, these tires need to be a changing. And I like the little graphics of grass on the front tires when you go through the grass. It, it's it's just little touches like that make the game so much more enjoyable. But the goal for this series is not winning. It's not winning, it's just not wrecking. Basically, and his teammates pulling into the pits right there. So that gives me another position. So there you go. It's more helpful advice from my spotter. And petrol's behind me. He's gonna get DRS. He's gonna do a little bit of blocking, just a little bit. So, that's halfway. It's the halfway mark of the race. Uh, so far, I believe I gained, like, two positions. But that's because everyone's pitting. So, my spotter said De La Rosa is getting prime tires, which means that the, those tires aren't as fast, but they last longer than these tires, which are option tires, which makes your car faster, but they don't last as long. So there's like a little bit of strategy planning going on in the races I'm going to be doing, but short ones like this are just going to be basically just use whatever. And sometimes the races will rain, sometimes the races won't rain. This one isn't going to rain, because I said it like that. I don't like it when it rains. It ruins my day. Petrol's gonna get DRS again. I'm stopping in three. Oh, he's already there. He's already going. He's on a mission. So. That right there. DRS is broken for me. Thanks, crew chief. 
course, I picked a team that's going out of the business because that is... Whoa, save it. Wow. That was skill. The car behind is running on the prime tire. We should try and create a gap. So there you go. Dropped some frames right there. Wow, Xbox, what's going on? Whoa. That's not good. There's been a crash in sector three. Yellow flag conditions. No overtake. Sector three. There's three different sections of the track and two people crashed. Oh no. Two people have crashed out. Top left. It used to say 24, now it says 22. That's not good. But that's more spots for me. Oh, there's some debris. That's probably where they crashed. There you go. Well, that's not good. I wonder... I wonder who it was. We're gonna have to look after the race. <sighs> so. I'm also gonna have to come up with, like, how many position finishes you get. Like, if you come in last, how much money you get. If you come in first, how much money you get. I, I probably won't base it off real life, because these cars... I'm not measuring everything else by real life, so if you if you come in last, you can become bankrupt in real life if you crash both your cars. But I'm probably going to start at 2 million, and each car is going to be like 1 million. Each front wing is going to be like 25,000. And also I'm going to have to like put in deductions for the pit crew pay and how much tires cost each weekend. Or weekend, as all of the announcers like to emphasize the end of the weekend word. <laughs> uh, boy. Oh. DR, 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 yes, DSL is still off. <laughs> DRS is still off on for me right now. kind of hoping that the game audio isn't going to come up on my microphone because that's just going to be annoying to edit as I say I wreck. I love how when I go back to edit stuff I just show it's why would I say that at this point? Like, really, there's something else happening and you're talking about this. That's just what happened when I spun back there. I'm like, oh, I should have said when I'm spinning. No, I'm talking about whatever I was just talking about because I already forgot. Ugh. Oh, that's interesting. The guy in front of me started on the other tires than everyone else. So. Alright, so I'm pitting the slap, so... That means you guys are going to see a four tire change in about five seconds. It's ridiculous. And I still have no DRS. Don't know why this hasn't come back online yet. Boo, Vettel. Boo. No one likes Vettel. I don't know why. I think it's because it's just like Jimmy Johnson in NASCAR. He always wins all the time, so no one likes him. It's interesting on how that happens. You can be the underdog and everyone loves you, or you can win all the time and no one likes you. Alright, here we go. Last turn. I'm pitting right there. These guys are being held up behind me. I'm just going to take the corner in really sharp right here, follow this blue line, and that's the wall. Whoa, 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 whoa. Put my fuel down to lean so I can save some while going through this pit road right here. And there we are. 
And there's four tires in almost four seconds. And I'm in control. I'm in. This is like the narrowest pit exit I have ever raced in. That's something we're going to have to deal with this series too. With the faster cars passing you and you get the blue flag, which means pull over so you don't get in their way. But if I was in a Ferrari, everyone else would be doing that for me. And I like Ferraris. They're cool. There it is again. Go, just go. God. Weber. Ugh. I don't really like the Red Bull guys. I don't know why. So let's see. Really, they're on lap 15 because I'm one lap down. They just finished lap 15, so it's basically lap 16 right now. If that's not confusing enough, you wait. Wait until I'm three laps down, or a weird seven laps down. Because no one likes working with sevens, unless you win the lottery. There goes a the Ferrari, right there. That, that red one. And I, I'd say I did pretty good during this race. Hopefully I'm going to be able to keep it up on the longer ones. Uh, also going to try to talk to myself while concentrating on something that will ruin your day. I say ruin your day because when you do the longer races and something stupid happens, like the power goes out, which happened to me before, it's just the most annoying thing in the world. Because, like, you're running first, and there's, like, two laps to go, and you spent, like, an hour of your time. Then you get nothing. God. There's the cars I like. Force India. I like those. I don't know why. Vettel sets another fastest lap. So, I'm basically... The really, really slow guys that you see in a race. Yes! Got DRS. See how my wing's up now? I'll show you what it does. I'll show you what it doesn't look like without DRS. It, that, that's what it normally looks like. If you want to see it again, just play back the video. I'm concentrating over here. So there are some interesting racetracks on the circuit that go all over the world. Uh, I believe the, the first race was in Australia, the Malaysia, then China. I believe the third race is China. But I know Australia, the Malaysia is absolutely right. Okay. Since I'm a lap down, I believe this is my final lap. So, tell me what you guys like of the series, or think the series is going to be. Dropping frame rates again. Xbox, what are you doing? I can't wait for the new Xbox One, but that's a topic for another video. Not this one, because this one I finished 22nd of 24. Ooh, Ricardo. Ooh, debris. So Ricardo is one of the guys who crashed. He races a Toro Rosso, which is like a secondary team for Red Bull. 
wonder, I wonder what happened there. Of course, we won't be able to find out, but we'll be able to find out who the other guy is. And Lewis Hamilton takes the checker flag and wins the race for himself and his McLaren crew. I, like, tried to do a British accent, but then I stopped myself. Interesting. Go up to Rich for this final straight. And this will be a great video. Someone's in the pits on the last lap. I wonder why they did that. Over there. That dramatic ending. 22nd position held. So that's where I started. 22nd, finished 22nd. That's a good day for me. On the hardest difficulty in the worst car. I think that's pretty good. And Kobayashi. Ricardo and Kobayashi tangled in turn one. On that one lap that I don't remember. So, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like the video. Subscribe to our other... Well, subscribe to this channel for some other series. Like some Halo and, I believe, Pokemon now. I'm sorry. Um, comment on what you think. And thanks so much for watching. Goodbye.